Bee's Eatery in Ogden is truly a one-stop shop. They have everything there from drinks to appetizers to full meals. And we are here with the partner and co-owner, Vivi, and she is joining us now to talk about her dry cocktails. We don't say mocktails because there's such an art and craft to these drinks, isn't there? There is, there is. We put a lot of thought and a lot of love into making the cocktails. And you know, if you come to WB's Eatery, we, are, we have a full liquor license, so uh, we can make any cocktails dry because we have non-alcoholic bourbon, we have non-alcoholic tequila, gin, absinthe, I mean, uh, wine, beer, you name it, we have it. So for us, we just wanna make sure that everybody feels included. You wanna drink? We got you. You don't want to drink? We got you, too. And you can participate. So often, non drinkers feel like they have no options. Right? They get a Diet Coke. That's Soda. What they do. Yeah, Soda. or milk. Mm -hmm. or whatever How fun it is might that? Be. No you, fun. You need to be able to cheer with your friends. Yeah, and you make it so beautiful that you wouldn't even notice or tell the difference because they no. smell alike too. They smell alike. We use the same uh, glassware because we drink, we eat with our eyes and we drink with our eyes. So it needs to look beautiful and that's what we want to do. You know, every cocktail is a craft cocktail and we want to make sure that everybody has fun and participate. All right, so, what are you making for us on the show today? I am making a non-alcoholic uh, margarita. So we're going to use a non-alcoholic tequila. Um, so we do uh, one and a half ounce of the tequila, and then we do two ounces of the mixer, margarita mixer, and we sell these online and we sell them at the store too. So when you get home, all you, can, you have to do is mix your drink and pour it in a glass of, um, with ice. I rimmed the glass. I just with had salt? with uh -huh. salt. Okay. Some, at the restaurant, we use salt and tahin. Uh -huh. So it adds a little bit uh, more flair to it. I also add a little bit of um, simple syrup to mm -hmm. make it, you know, to give a little bit of sweetness, not too much. I think it depends on if you like it sweet or not. Uh, but I try not to make it too sweet for you. <laughs> and then here, we're going to try a little bit of, you know. I mean, this looks like. You are at some fabulous restaurant having, oh, I mean, I, that's probably all I need. <laughs> <laughs> that's mine. Actually, I, actually, you actually I need the full one. <laughs> yes. It looks so good. No, I mean, this looks like you called it a craft. Craft cocktail. because Dry cocktail. cocktail. Dry, cocktail. Dry cocktail. I like that more than the mocktail. It is, okay. just because, you know, we, we put a lot of love into Cheers. it. And I'm going to cheer mm -hmm. with you, too. What have people been saying when they are wow, able to that is do? Really good. Isn't it? Mm. Wow. Mm -hmm. What do people say when they, when they feel like they're not being singled out and they get to order basically the same thing that's non-alcoholic? They like to feel included. No one wants to be called out for not drinking, right? And we are always mm. saying, you good? know, it's the slow to know. You want to have a few drinks and then at the end of the night you want to slow down, you switch to non-alcoholic cocktails. You know, if you want to just, for uh, health reasons or whatever reasons, if you just want to stay with a non-alcoholic, you can too. For us, it's um, always make it inclusive and people feel mm. good when they have yeah. something well, nice to drink. It's still part of the experience. I yes. mean, that's what dining out and going out is all about. What else do you have there? We have meals, so we can have, we have bruschettas, we have made in cheese boards, we have my mom's chimichurri recipe on the menu. Uh, it comes with vinaigrette, I'm from Brazil, so it has a little bit of a Latin flair. Um, Vivi, what else you're serving up is a great deal, February 10th, tell us about that event. Yes, February 10th, we have a wine and design event. Uh, we partner with the flor florist, so you will come in, uh, you're gonna learn how to make a floral arrangement, and then uh, the $95 ticket includes the, floor, the flowers, uh, two glasses of wine, with or without alcohol, and a meat and cheese board. So we can all just mingle, have fun, and bring a beautiful bouquet home for Valentine's Day. I feel like we all need to drive to Ogden immediately. Uh -huh. Yes, please. Yes, so go to our website, everyone. We'll put all the information right there about the event and their location, abc4.com slash daily dish. All right, Thank cheers. You so much. Cheers. Uh -huh. mm -hmm. Salute. Yep, there we go, all okay. three of us all now. Cheers. There we go. Cheers. Go to WB's Eatery.